Hello singers! Today we are going to read Caro mio ben as if we were speaking Italian. Alright? Let's begin from the first verse. Caro mio ben you You have to focus on the K, 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 K. The A is just A. So we have to pronounce it A. Mouth a little open. A. As if we were saying A. That's good. Oh, I don't know. Like um, just. The A of just. So it's like just. Like must, ah, ah, ka, ka, and the k, 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 so hard, k, k. Then follow the r, which is rrr. Start breathing before doing it, like like a bowel exercise, but sounding, <laughs> not like, rrr. it's like rrr, rrr. The tongue is moving inside the mouth freely, so you have to breathe in order to do it, just to practice it. So, breathe, breathe, so let's do it together. Car, car, it's not car, car, it's car. Caro, o, o, caro. Let's divide the two syllables. <clears throat> ka ro you ka ro we have two o's in italian the first is o o wide open o o the, the mouth is a little more open you want the here the jaw open it okay then the o o O. Let's practice the difference between the O and the O. We have just these two O's, but you have to do it. Just practice. O and O. O, O. O, O. Focus on the sound. It's just these two sounds. You don't have others, so don't worry about that. Just two. You have to practice only two sounds. Ka, Ro. This O is a Closed O, O, O. It's not the open O, but O. Okay? So, caro. You do it. Caro. Mi, O. The O is the same. M, M, M. It's like your mouth. M, 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 mouth. The same M. But the E is quite different. I mean, uh, your e, e is a E, E. It's different. While we do it, like quite e, e, very, you, you, can you hear it? It's like e, e, e. Try it. Mio, mio. Then when you sing, you don't have to say to do this with your, with your mouth. Me, me, me. This is the pronunciation of the, of the spoken language, but, but you have to know how it sounds. So when you will do it, me, 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 you will know how it sounds. You will think the right vowels and you will pronounce it respecting the, the technique, of course. So, me, mio, mio. No, nothing more than this M. E O mio mio ben. Here we have the b b b b same as yours b b b. All right. So uh, ben uh, the the e in this case is pronounced open wide. We have two e's in Italian, which is the open one e. E and the closed one. E, E. Only these two sounds. Now you practice. E, E, you. And the closed one. E, E, you try. 
Okay, this word ben comes from bene. Here we have uh, this word which is the short form ben. Uh, when we speak we say bene and uh, you can also hear some other language um, singers uh, saying bene with the closed e. E, bene. So you can, I mean, you can choose. It depends on uh, on your uh, on how it sounds to you. If you are used to hear singers that say bene or singers that say bene, actors would say bene, but singers can choose because if they are mother language, they tend uh, to. Um, keep their pronunciation, their spoken pronunciation. So you can hear both, bene or bene. So in this case, you could hear caro mio ben or caro mio ben. But this sounds pretty bad, doesn't it? Uh, in this precise case, caro mio ben is much better. So let's try to do it uh, all together, all the sentences together. Be careful, not only the vowels are important, we sing on the vowels, but the consonants make the pronunciation clear. So, a good pronunciation makes a good singing. So, we have to work on the consonants too. And, and our consonants are really different. Just focus on everything. Caro mio ben. You. Okay. In this case, we have cr, 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 credimi almen, credimi almen. Okay, let's try. Cre, cre. Here we have we have again k, 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 r. So let's do it. K, 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 k together. K, k. Cannot do it, just practice with your breathing. You are singers, so you can do it. It's not difficult for you. It's like, it, actors forgive me, it's like being a little uh, actors because we have to be free to move our articulation. So we just have to, to try everything, okay? Especially um, when we sing. In, uh, in in languages that are not our mother language. Okay, so let's try. K k k. R r r. E e e. D d d. Listen, this D. It's not D D. It's D D D D D. The tongue on the palate. D without bursting. It's not d d d. It's d d d. Try d d d. Just a little movement, a little bit. Credi, credi, credi. Again, this e, which is not e. It's not credimi. It's credi me. Okay, so E, E, it sounds very strong. You can hear the E. Credimi. Credimi. Okay, again. Credimi. You try. Credimi. Credimi. Now we are cutting the words and the syllables, but then we'll have to do it fluent, okay? As if we were speaking Italian, right? Almen, almen, al, a, again the a, the Italian a, careful, a, a, always the same sound. Al, 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 but like, l is the same, like lower, lower, it's not all, all. No, it's not a back L, it's l, 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 almen, almen, closed E, almen, okay, 
So let's do it together. Credimi al men. You can hear credimi al men. This E and this A, this I and this A are together. Credimi al men. Very good. Senza di te. Senza di te. So we have the S. 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 This is S. Like sound. Same S. Hmm? Se. Uh, sorry, sorry. I, when I speak, I say senza. Without. Means without. And I say senza. It depends if you are from the north of Italy or the south of Italy or the center. And... Um, uh, so, uh, where I was born, we say senza. So, I grew up like that. I'm sorry, sometimes it comes up. Um, it's senza. Se, se, se. You try. Se, sen, sen. Now, uh, concentrate on that. It's not senza. Never do that. It's really funny. It's really funny, so don't do it. Senza is funny, sounds funny, so don't do it. Mm, senza. Sen. Tz, 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 it's not z, z. It's not z. It's not z. It's tz, 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 very short sound. We also have the other z. Z, z, but we use it in other words, in other situations. Okay, so just forget it for a while. You have to practice the tz, 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 try it. Tz, tz, you. When you practice, uh, record what you're doing so you can compare. Okay, senza, senza. Okay, so it's a very like it's the same, the same sound. It's not the same uh, letter, but in any case, it's, it's, you have it. So, sen, tsa, tsa, tsa. All right, sen, tsa. D, again the D, D in Italian is D, 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 D. This is quite different. D, D, it's like the same different as we have from the T's. T, T, D, D. T, t, d, d, it's much bad. D, 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 it's not bad, it's, the tongue is on the paddle. So, just hear it and repeat it. This is the only way, okay? Senza di te. And careful, here we have the D and the T quite close. So, we have to be careful here. We, we cannot say senza di te. It's sen. Sa di te. In this case, te has the closed e, 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 e. We say it e. And di te. Your pronunciation sounds Italian if you pronounce the correct consonants here. It's very important. So no z, no d, not t. Again, se. Sorry. <laughs> Senza. Di te, di, di, of, it means of, of, di, di, of, te, you, te, 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 okay, senza di te, you try, senza di te, you, senza di te, you, senza di te. Oh, here we have languisce. Lang, lang, l a n. Langui. Gui, g, g. Gui. Languisce. Sh, 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 sh. Let's do it. Lang in syllables. Gui, sh. It's just one word. Lan. Gui, she. You can do it with me, okay? Right? Lan, gui, she. Try. She. Very good. Il, the, cor, heart. Okay. So languisce. You do it together. Languisce. All. Um, 
languisce languisce il cor never forget to let your eyes smile while you pronounce a language so it will be easier for you to articulate hmm? all right so languisce il cor languisce il cor you can um, you can hear uh, that when you um, pronounce the the whole sentence uh, you don't you don't have silences you don't make pauses you, it's just all spoken uh, the same mistake we do when we when we start learning another language everybody does this thing we uh, just stop but we don't have to stop we have to speak fluently and speaking fluently we just put all the words of the sentence together as if we were as if they were one so languisce il cor look at the mouth moving and try it languisce il cor remember that cor it's the short form of core which is the ancient word for cuore which is nowadays nowadays the word for heart cuore we say cuore but here we have cor mm? so the r has to sound you cannot say co or cor that's not that, that doesn't sound good mm? languisce il cor Okay. Caro mio Ben, again, senza di te languisce il cor. This is all the sentence that, you know, it's repeated twice. So, let's do it from the beginning, everything. Mm. Caro mio Ben, you. Credimi almen, you. Senza di te, you. Languisce il cor, you. Caro mio Ben, you. Senza di te, you. Languisce il cor, you. Very good. Of course, it's quite impossible if, uh, if we don't learn a language when we are children uh, to be perfect so nobody can be perfect I I'm, I'm not saying that you have to be perfect uh, of course not it's just and I I just mean to help you as as much as I can in order to go much closer to the right pronunciation so just do your best and you'll be perfect okay that's good it, it's not mm, perfect perfect I mean it's just the, the way it makes your sound be wonderful, okay? So, I'm sure you can do it. It's not difficult. I mean, it's just practice, practicing, practicing. Okay, so let's go on. It's il tuo fedel. Careful, here we have il, the i, e, il, which is the, the, the article, the, and then tuo, tuo, yours. Tuo, your. Tuo, il tuo fedel. Fedel. F e d e a l. Fe, fe, del. Don't say fedel or fidel. Fidel, fidel. No. Fedel. The e's are sound the same. Fe del, fe del. So don't move your mouth when you change the uh, the consonant. Fe del, fe del. Okay, so you try. Il tuo fe del. Try. Okay. Sospira ognor. Sos. Sospira, try, sos, closed, o, sospira, p, p, like 
pa pa power like pound like <laughs> sauce pira try sauce pira onor this sound which is g n and we pronounce it ny we don't have the gn gn this is a sound we don't have anytime you see a g n closed we pronounce it ny 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 try ny it's quite funny ny 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 ony ony any any ony any any ing ony ony just practice ony you any any ing ony okay Onyor, onyo, onyo, onyo. You try. Onyo, nya, nya. Onyor, with R, final R, sounding. So, onyor, onyor. Okay. Il tuo fedel. Sospira ognor. Cessa crudel. Cessa means stop. So, cessa. It's not cesa uh, or cesa. It's ch, ch, ch. In this case, the C is pronounced ch. We have two Cs. K, k, the of. Caro, C of caro is the K, like your K, I mean, K, 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 while the C of cessa is the Ch, 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 so we have to say this is not Cessa, it's Cessa, open E, Ch, Ch, Cessa, Cessa. Double S. When you pronounce a double S, it sounds all the time. It's not, it's not like a double T. Or double T like tutto. This is the word for all. Or whole. Depends. So, uh, if you want to say this consonant, double, in Italian, you just have to wait to stay there. <laughs> and this is a double. While here we have the double S, it sounds so it's pretty easy. Chessa, chessa. You have to find the rhythm of the word, you know? It's like music. Chessa. It's not chesa or chesa. <laughs> the sound. Chessa. All right. Chessa crudel. Chessa and cru, cru, cru. Crudel is cruel. So you have to say k r u cru u. Our u is like the u u u the sound of the monkey. So <laughs> so cru u u cru cru del cru del cru del cessa crudel. Try Everything, cessa crudel. Don't stop. Okay. Tanto, tanto, tanto. You can hear this N, it's quite a, a nasal. Tanto. Don't say tanto. Tanto. This is a, a T with a A and a, another T. While you have to say ta, ta. Uh, do you remember the Italian A? It's just A, ah, A. Ah, simply this sound. This one and only. So, ta, ta, tanto. Tanto. So you have the t sound. T, which is not t, t, t. T, 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 t. Try it. T. Tanto. Tanto. It's just a little movement. Not t, t, the interest, all the mouth. It's just t, 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 a little 
movement of the tongue on the palate, like the same thing. Ta ta ta, tan to, tan to. You try. Rigor, rigor. Here you have the R sound, the I, the Italian I, e e e, g g g g. It's the, the G is g g g. So it's a heart sound. You can, you can you can hear it. So rigor, ri, gor, like gall. <laughs> Okay, singers, I really hope you found this video useful and uh, please, if you want like it, subscribe my videos and my channel and uh, let me know if you really need something specific. I'm here for you. Good singing, everybody. Bye-bye.